Butler will kick off to start the second half. Robert Brooks is back deep to field it. And he'll take a knee and put the Packers at their own 20. Brett Favre threw an interception to Mark Carrier in the first quarter. And the Packers put together one decent drive that led to a field goal, but nothing much else. They have the upper hand. They're not the one with the injured players. Favre is sacked behind the line. Joe Kane, the middle linebacker, put him down. Loss of one on that sack. Favre has a split backfield. He'll hand off to Edgar Bennett. Bennett gets a gain of three. And he's down at the Green Bay 21. Third down and eight. Bennett, the lone setback. Three wide receivers and a tight end. Here's Favre. He throws for Brooks downfield. And the pass is caught by Robert Brooks. And that's a big first down catch for that young man. Brett Favre only has completed 55% of his passes. Either quarterback in this game has been doing nothing really. Though Walsh has the touchdown pass. Here's Favre. He's going to try and sling it again to Brooks. And he catches it and he's wide open. He's hawked from behind. And they finally brought him down at about the 8-yard line. Green Bay is knocking on the door trying to take the lead. Robert Brooks has got the hot hand. First and goal at the Chicago 8. We are at Soldier Field, one of the game's most storied rivalries, taking place right here. Bears and Packers. Bennett stopped behind the line. Everybody and their brother for the Bears defense went after Bennett, and the Green Bay offensive line could do nothing but cower and let him go by. Split backfield on second down. Far for Brooks. That man had the hot hand. We thought he did not catch the ball. That would have given Green Bay the lead. Third down and 12. Actually third and goal from the 12. Bennett gets the carry. And Bennett, Bennett got nine, but he's short. And so Jackie's going to come on and kick the field goal. And he misses a field goal from chip shot range. That's one of those moments where you cue those 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 losing horns from the prize is right when you miss a field goal from that range. That was a 20-yard field goal attempt. Walsh hands off to Spencer Tillman, and he was taken down immediately. He's Rashawn Salam's replacement. Second down and 14 for the Bears. They lead it 7-3. Walsh has Timpson open and Walsh overthrew him. Third down and 14. Ball at the Chicago 15. Here's Walsh. Has Harris. Raymond Harris gets it back to the original line of scrimmage. But nothing doing there the Bears will have to punt Kaplan will punt it again Chaffee back deep to field it short punt and Chaffee was able to get it past midfield to the Bear 43 good field position here by the Packers let's see if they can take advantage they missed the field goal on their last offensive possession but it looked like that Brooks was had the hot hand this is was that Favre who ran that Packers pulling out all the stops. Second down and six after a gain of four. Favre looks. He has time. Has Ingram. No, he does not. He had him. But just too far in front of him. Third down and six now for the Packers. Split backfield for Green Bay. Favre under center. He'll hand off to Edgar Bennett. And Edgar Bennett drags a man across the first down marker. He didn't get it. They say he was a foot short. Boy, you got to go for it here in the Packers' will. Three wide receivers on tight end for the Packers. And Edgar Bennett gets more than enough for Green Bay first down. Gain of three on the run. Ball now on the 31. First down and ten. 
55 seconds remaining in the third quarter. Favre is going to step forward and has Mark Ingram. Six yard gain. Brett Favre not so much looking to dink to uh, throw it downfield. He looks to be more conservative here on this drive. Defensive shift for the Bears. Three wide receiver, four wide receivers for the Bears. Ingram is the intended receiver and he's overthrown. Fortunately for Favre, that wasn't intercepted. Third down and three at the Chicago 24. Far from the shotgun, and now he has four wide receivers. He's from the spread. He's got Brooks. Brooks has got a Green Bay touchdown, and they'll give Green Bay the lead. They have been working on that connection all game. 24 yards out. Robert Brooks from Brett Farr. So now... Chris Jackie will add the extra point. He missed a field goal from about the same distance earlier in the quarter. But this field goal is right through the uprights. It is good. And Green Bay has taken the lead. They lead at 10-7. With 15 seconds remaining in the third quarter. Tillman back deep to return it for the Bears. And Tillman gets a gain of 15. And the Bears will probably get off one more play before the quarter ends. Well, this fourth quarter may be a good one. Walsh will hand off to Raymond Harris. And Harris will be stopped after a gain of three. That's the end of the third quarter with our score. Green Bay 10 and Chicago 3 will return to Soldier Field after perhaps a word from, hell, I don't know.